Boo. Hey, you two world. Hey, Kirkpatrick. Uh, thanks for dropping in. Man, it's been a while, hasn't it? I don't know, man. One, two, maybe three months since I posted a video. I've been busy, folks, living life. Heck, I'm 70 years old. And got things to do, people to see, places to go, and what have you. But for those that are, are, are new here, uh, I'll give you a quick background on me. I'm just a good old boy who lives in, Oak, uh, in Georgia. <laughs> Moving to Oklahoma here shortly. Soon, I hope. But, uh, yeah, I like to pick and grin, and uh, uh, I, I partake in the shooting sports. I'm, I'm a pretty renowned trapper. And, uh, Excellent revolver shooter. Make a little money on doing that. Anyhow, <clears throat> that, that, that's me. Pest control business for 20 uh, something years. Anyway, so being who I am and what I do, and you know, trapped alligators and you know, all kinds of stuff, but anyhow. Got a call from my buddy at State Bow today, and he said, hey, man. He said, we got a call from South Carolina. If y'all hear something like, sound like a dog snorting in the background, it is. That's my buddy's foot. He whipped me 90% of the time. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. Yeah, I got a call from Bowie. We put together a team that, you know, uh, need some help over in South Carolina catching some monkeys. I said, yeah, I seen that on the news, Bowie. He said, yeah. He said, well, they called and wanted to know if we could help put together, you know, folks. And they wanted to know if we had any advisory people. And he said, I thought of you. I said, well, you know, I ain't never caught no monkey, but. I ain't seen nothing I couldn't outsmart yet. Other than that clock right there. He said, well, yeah, can I count you in? And I said, well, I don't know. I said, how much did it pay? Oh, I, it's volunteer. Volunteer? Yeah, yeah. I just need a little hex, extra help. So I tell you what, Bo, I said, I'm I'm a little tired of volunteering for people's mistakes. I don't mind volunteering for acts of God and nature and stuff. But uh So I tell you what, Bo. So I'm gonna pass this time, but I tell you, I, I said, I don't know who you're talking to, but you tell them I can solve that problem. I'll bring a crew over there and Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know. Once I get there, I can tell you, but in four to, four to ten days, I'll, have, I'll, I'll get all them monkeys rounded up for them. And, and I, yeah, I won't charge them at 4.2 million. You know, Bo, he laughed. <laughs> yeah, it just sounds like you. He is always about the money, ain't you? And I said, well, I don't, I don't Bo, I don't know always about the money, but I ain't got a lot of other things going on in my life, me. Running around South Carolina in the thickets over there chasing monkeys. If I can get her done, 4.2 million, I'm just telling you, I'm serious, it's a heart attack. I said, all right, I'll, I'll talk to you later. And he hung up, you know. Right. By God, about two hours later, the phone rang the bull again. Yeah, bull was up. Oh, uh, you serious about that? <clears throat> about what? I knew what he's called back for. <laughs> he, about, about, about getting them monkeys over in South Carolina and, and, and getting them all back at home and four point two million. You, you can do it. You can get it done for that. Yeah, I can get it done for that. He said, "Well, I thought you were serious, but they asked me. I just kind of mentioned it off cuff, talking to the dude, you know, kind of laughing about. It. I ain't. I ain't got three people going over there, and I'm one of them." He said, you know, I couldn't get, you know, anybody want to go over. 
everybody's got a busy schedule, holidays are coming up, you know, and who wants to go try to chase a monkey? A monkey make a fool out of you, you ain't careful. And, uh, and uh, he said, but I got to mention that about you, and, and you know, the, the guy over there had heard of you before about some other stuff. I said, I'm sure it was all good, wasn't it, Mo? And he said, well, I don't know. It might have been back in your poaching days, is, and they couldn't ever catch you. And I said, well, <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm serious. He said, well, I'll call you back. <clears throat> he called me back 10 minutes later. He said, uh, I'm fixing to text you a number. Can you fax on your letterhead? Uh, to uh, he named out this company. I'm not gonna mention it on there. It's actually the company that owns the research facility. Can you fax them your quote of you know safely catching and returning the monkeys uh, to their domicile, you know, location? Well, yeah, I can do it. So, so they may bite on this, huh? I said, yeah, they may bite. He said, if you need to hire me on the weekends, I'm available. <laughs> it's all right. So uh, I sent it in. Let her hear it up. Faxed it. And you know, they wanted a backup email to this guy. Uh. And I copied the state on it, and I copied uh, Bo, which is Georgia, and I copied the state of South Carolina on it. And uh, I got an email back uh, saying they were considering it. I wanted to know when I could start. And. Uh, was that price firm? And uh, emailed him back and said, yes. I can do the job. I can start at daylight. And the price is definitely firm. He emailed me back and said, hold off. We'll call you. So I know what that means, you know. You go to Nashville, play for somebody, and they say, oh, hey, you sound great. Yeah, yeah, we'll call you. Next. So I figured out that's what that was. And uh, that's exactly what it was. I ain't heard nothing since. <laughs> that's the story. <clears throat> as it uh, unfolds right now and it's yeah, been a couple of days since all that went down so uh and i did a lot of research immediately you know google earth the whole place and realized it's a little kind of like an island or a river split. anyway i know i know all about it now and, you know all i can decipher that satellites and imagery can can bring me in uh, got a couple friends in South Carolina, but none of them are really familiar with that area of South Carolina. It's like, well, nobody goes there. It's not, there's nothing goes on there. It's, there's nothing there. It floods every now and then, too. You know. you know. Hmm. Anyway, so I'm back, Jax. Thought I'd just throw that story out there. And, uh interesting if it changes i'll give y'all an update and, uh when i get back on here again who knows i'm just having too much fun uh living life and i've been living life now i'm trying to prepare for the next stage and uh yes yeah, there's a lot of things you have to do but uh Hopefully I got time to do them. I've been chiseling at them just a little bit each day. You know. God bless y'all. God bless America.
Edgar Bedrick. Adios.